So this will be an energy read. I hope you like the video. If you do, please do like it. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And thank you very much. Hi, I'm Mark, and this is my journey through tarot. Come on. So, energy read for you today. So this is a time to just kind of consider what it is that you want to get out of this reading. and um, Or if you've already finished your day and you're looking at this at the end of your day, maybe see how it'll apply to, to what happened to you today. Okay, so have you taken a minute to just settle down, settle in, and uh, uh, just observe the reading and see how it applies to what's happened to you this day or maybe what you're looking forward to. Okay, so these are good. These are the Tarot Mucha. This is another Los Scarabio, but they come in a cool case, which I love. And these cases are so useful when they stand up like this, because you can take the little booklet out and you still have the cards kept nicely there. And these have an, a good booklet. I mean, it's, it's cool looking paper. Uh, it's got uh, interesting uh, suggestions for divination of the cards. And, uh, you know, it's, la it'll, it's lasty. So we have that. Now the cards, I'll show you before we get started are right, easy to use they've got they're beautiful on the back and uh, they're really nice uh, on the front and they're not too hard to interpret I mean they're typical uh, rider weight uh, iconography and uh, you can figure out what they mean without very much trouble at all so you know if you don't get to look at a lot of cards tune in to me and then you're gonna see some kind of cards because I'm getting them all the time and um, at one point we'll have to start to give some of these away because I've just got too many but uh, not now, because I love everything I've got. Very greedy. But uh, hopefully these cards will give us some good answers. And we'll get working on that. Tarot Mucha. Done in the uh, style of the artist uh, Alphonse Mucha. Google it. Okay, so this energy read is going to be uh, either direction or uh, help in deciphering uh, maybe what's been going on. So energy read. But usually I'll either say that this is going to be uh, a forward movement with this energy. Okay, these are beautiful cards, and uh, Alphonse Mucha. You should Google him. He's got some beautiful art there. It can be very inspiring, very soothing, and always seems to have some sort of a message in there, even if it's just beauty. So energy read for you today. Full Celtic cross. We'll take six right away. So this is one, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay. The signifier card of this energy reading for you today is this uh, number 10 is the Wheel of Fortune. I want to make sure. Yep. So is this number 10 is the Wheel of Fortune. So um, knowing that things are, are always, uh, the wheel's always spinning, and uh, sometimes the ride can be, you know, um, tiresome. You know, it can be a journey. But that wheel of fortune is always turning around, and so if, if whatever it is now is it what you want, something else is going to be later. And uh, if you're having a great time right now, soak it up and prepare yourself for when maybe things aren't uh, as uh, perfect as they are. So that's the signifier of this uh, energy read. Uh, the challenge to this is the five, six, seven, eight. Eight is strength. Okay, so yeah, so this is the major arcana. This is well on the journey, and it, you know there, you have the strength to get this done. But and it doesn't have to be a big push. It doesn't have to be a dredge. Okay, just a little kindness, just an understanding, or um, may, that might be what you need. On the basis of this uh, this uh, reading, today is the uh, Magician. The first card of the Major Arcana, the Fool's just started his journey and runs into this fellow with all the answers. All the answers are right here, and so when that is the base of your reading, you should understand, dig deep, and uh, you're going to see um, uh, how we can get this moving. The uh, past to this reading was the tower card. So once that's happened, once we've had that full stop, then we know that uh, this is what I'm left to deal with. And uh, you have to understand it's time to just take a deep breath and move forward. Sky this reading 
is this Nine of Pentacles. And so you want to shoot for just all the worth you can possibly luxuriate in. Just try to shoot for the best outcome ever possible. You're right on top of that Wheel of Fortune. And the likely uh, outcome of this first part of this is the all these major arcana cards. So this is the uh, 10, 15, 16, 17. So this is the star. The star is um, really soaking up all that glory and showing the way for everybody else. Okay, She understands who she is. She's confident. And uh, that's uh, how you should think of yourself. Last four cards of this full Celtic cross. I think I'm going to take them one at a time. Uh, the self of this uh, issue, this day, this energy, is this great big offer of value, okay? It's just radiating out from the side, and there's options of how to go about this. There's a portal here, and it's just a great big uh, positive uh, energy for the energy read. The uh, environment that that's in, even, is the sun. So we got the star, we got the big, great big offer, and we got the sun. So this is, you know, everything uh, that that you will need. Um, the, the hopes and the fears of this. This nine of, of wands is probably the fear, is that when things are going so well, maybe there's a lot of plans, a lot of actions, and um, and this maiden does look distressed, but she's got a plan in her, firmly in her hand, and these other uh, uh, options, these other actions, these other situations are, are well-placed, and she'll be able to deal with them. So that's the hopes and the fears. And then the um, likely outcome of the whole thing is this the end near the end of the journey with this uh, judgment? So this uh, twenty of the major arcana is just telling us, okay, look to judgment. If you've gone things about the right way, this is something you can look forward to. Okay, so that's what we got for that energy read for you today. Okay, so I hope that was good for you today. Uh, just reflect on it. It may apply to you. It may apply to someone that you care for. And uh, if it doesn't work out for you, then it wasn't a reading for you today. Just let it rest. I'm Mark, my journey through tarot. Tomorrow's another day. Stop by. We'll do it again. Ciao for now.